be in a space where it doesn't matter what I identify as. I'm a person who loves God. J.B. Bradley attends Powell Presbyterian Church, a small, tight-knit congregation that embraces members of the LGBTQ community and recognizes them as full members of the Christian faith. Reverend Katina Sharp says people often walk through her doors with a history of painful experiences. We recognize that if we hurt them, there are many of them who would never try again. And so it's a huge responsibility uh, to, to say you're an affirming church, to actually live into that. And Reverend Sharp says the key to combating trauma is love. Like, let's take it back to the basics. What does it really mean? Just love your neighbor, right? Who cares what your neighbor looks like? Who cares what your neighbor loves? None of that matters. Bradley grew up in a church where she was taught love and acceptance. But she worried she might not be received the same way after coming out. She stayed away from church for more than a decade. But she says her belief in God never wavered. It was her fear of rejection that kept her away. The want never died. It was a little overwhelming when I started coming here. I just didn't realize how much I missed it. She found Powell Presbyterian through friends and has been attending for a year and a half. I think she began to heal from some of those messages that she had been told and to open herself up to becoming more vulnerable. It's a beautiful thing to find somewhere that you feel like you belong because those spaces are far and few and you know in between for anyone that's different, whether it's queer or not. So. Jillian Taylor on that story. Powell Presbyterian Church will host a Pride Month sermon later on June 23rd. It does start at 1030 and everyone is welcome to attend.